visual configuration of three on the onside. That's the short boundary. Skies it, catches the call. Delita running back with the flight and gloves it. Good wicket keeping. Pace off from Tash Farron. The acting captain Luce is gone. She was the danger bat as well, Sunny Luce. She's been in the runs, in amongst the runs so far in this tournament. And this is the left arm, the scrambled ball. It's the surprise ball. Doesn't, there's no foot movement, doesn't get under it. It's a big slice. In the end, an easy catch there for the leader of the Netherlands. And another one bites the dust. They're third for three now, the Tornado, Tornadoes. And falling fast out of this game. Well, Sunil Lees, she's got to go for 13. The Tornadoes, 30 for three. Tries two. That's going nowhere. Only into the hands of Katie Mack at backward point. Barrett gets a second. This is all but done now. The Tornadoes in a world of pain. Just about out of the competition. Yeah, must win game for both of these teams. And the Sapphires really have turned up today. And Riaz, you can understand what she's trying to do. She's trying to go up and over extra cover. But Katie Mack's not dropping that. And the celebrations come out. Aliyah Riaz, she's got to go for 10. And the Tornadoes, they're tumbling here. They're 52 for four. She needs to sort of run. In at six and won't clear cover. Tash Farrance on a hat trick. Straight to the captain, San Amir. Not quite a replica of the previous dismissal, but the process was the same for Farrant. Set it well outside the off stump, run her fingers down the ball, and let the batters throw it away. It's clever bowling, really clever bowling, because she is bowling to the shorter side as well. She has to protect that short boundary. So she's hanging the ball right outside the off stump. Somebody keep her out of the game. What a day she is having. Another wicket goes, it's a golden duck. The Tornadoes are 52 for five.